time. If I tell people usually that uh, I'm an astronaut or I work in CERN on particle physics, people's reaction is very positive, very enthusiastic, and they're very in awe of the work I do. But actually, if I tell them I'm really working on soil science, uh, their enthusiasm seems to drop. But if we try to explain to people that from soil, people get all the food that they uh, have to eat, it controls the water supply, it protects the environment, and actually it ensures that there is uh, life on Earth, then that's the issue that we are trying to address at the JRC. So what we try to do is to very much raise awareness of the importance of soil, uh, both to society at large and also to the policymakers. It's important to realise that a lot of soil processes are very slow and maybe they don't match uh, political timeframes of administrations and governments. So what we try to do is to carry out research that demonstrates the importance of soil, where soils are providing certain ecosystem services and actually where they're most at risk from degradation processes very often associated to the way the land is being used. So uh, within the EU, soil appears in a number of uh, very strong policy areas. The most obvious one is the common agricultural policy, where soil protection is fundamental to a number of uh, specific areas. But also in environment, soil is also very important in relation to habitat protection, in terms of biodiversity, desertification, uh, flood mitigation, and possibly very importantly in terms of climate change, where soils actually store organic carbon, which is a byproduct of carbon dioxide, in the ground and its storage there depends on the way that the land is managed. 2015 is the International Year of Soils as designated by the United Nations. And this is really a benchmark to raise global awareness of the importance of soils. And that's why the JRC is really trying to engage with people at large through the visitor centre, but also through our Atlas series and in public events across Europe.